You did that expression in last year's video. Let's have a new one. And that's without one Mount Margarita. Yeah, really. Check that. Bill Shelley, the sober one in the group. I'm drinking Pepsi, no margaritas. Okay, and the only real comic book fan, my son John. <laughs> Look at that, he's reading at the table. These other guys are just playing on getting drunk and laid tonight. Okay, there we go, that's our obligatory. Okay, right there, Richard Fryer. That's right. Now let's turn this around. Hi folks. There Upside down. There we go. Like that's the way I see life, is topsy-turvy. <laughs> now let's see. It's, are you sure? Yes. I sworn you I, said I've never seen a Tracy Lord's video. <laughs> I've never around. seen a Tracy Lord's video. The world's two biggest Tracy Lord's fans right here. And I've never seen one. Yeah, right. I never saw one. Anyway, okay, as I was saying, notice the Dave Stevens cover artwork. He did this because he thinks that the babe that started this movie is really hot. What do you think? Not she looks as good as the artwork, it'll be fine. Okay. Okay, your turn. What did you get that was excited? Our waiter is wondering what the hell's going on at this table. He just wants another waiter to come over. <laughs> All right, Dwight. Here, I got Dwight. What am I saying? Dwight's what am I saying, Dwight? I've been waiting for Dwight to come up, so I want, I want to introduce him to Betty Page bondage photos. Here's William Snell, 50 convention sketches. Right idea. It, it, it looks just like a Richard Pryor fanzine. <laughs> <laughs> that good a quality, huh, Jim? Is that at his table? This is at right his idea. table. I'm gonna, again, it's limited edition. Yes, you should buy this. Limited to everybody that hey, buys one. we had breakfast with him. <laughs> Maybe he'll give us a discount. Him. No, that was up in Oakland. <laughs> what? That's, that's a breakfast that, discount. I'd, I'd like to wish Richard Pryor good luck on his auto race before he crashes and burns. <laughs> that's and right. And fiery death. And we'll have that videotape also after this. Video analyst. Okay, Bill, now what did you get? Wait, Wait a minute, we already saw what yeah, you we got. Yeah, see something, but I'm going to show you something else. All, All right. right. This is comic fan number one, a fanzine from 1962. This fanzine is the first fanzine ever published by Buddy Saunders, uh, Lone Star Comics. Now, is there any pornography in that, considering his current stance? <laughs> I doubt it. He was about what, 13 when this came out. Who was in this? Buddy Saunders. Really? This introduces the fan character, the demon. It's a 20 to 25 dollar fanzine. I got it for three bucks from uh, American Comic Book. Wait till the price guide comes out. Shock. Let me see that. Can I get, like, you know, salsa on this and everything? <laughs> get your head okay, your turn. Rusty, Here we go, Rusty. I have not paid for a second thing yet. But well, just show us the money in your wallet. Judy will want to know it's still there. <laughs> no, it spontaneously combusted yesterday at all the record stores. I did get Jerry Frost. I had a strong autograph. Yeah, they had a dark horse. Yeah, they had a dark horse retail booth. They had four copies. I got to buy one. Yeah. I got right. Jerry Frost an autograph, and I'll get Rick Gary. Right Sounds idea. good. Yeah. I already paid for it. And this is what I'm buying, folks. This is what I found <laughs> of interest. Thank you very much. Mas cerveza. I pushed the black button. I there you go. That's it. You can just okay. hold it. You don't even have to push anything. Okay. Great. All right, guys. Here we go. Okay. Second take. Okay. Trying to ignore me.